Hey, hey, it's Steve here at a different chick farm coming at you this evening. It is about 1030 and while most of y'all are comfortable in your recliner, which is where I was a little while ago, I have to come out here about 10, 1030 every evening and uh, check on my plants and make sure everything is going good. And I thought this evening would be a quick time quick and good chance to give you a quick little update here and talk about what we're doing so we'll switch the camera around and we'll take a look at that okay well here's what we've got we've done some additions to the place since you all have been here uh, we have added three new eight foot LED lights so we're trying these out I've got three more to put in also um, and think you all have done seen this got some peppers in here and some chamomile so got some tomatoes up here got a few over there that was early achievers that got a little leggy but they'll be okay we'll just plant them deep oh, we've got some uh red ghost pepper crosses and some chocolate seven pots some Tasmanian habaneros and some chocolate habaneros there. We got some serranos down here. Some big gems. Some more serranos. Oh, I can't see these from the back side, so I'm not sure what they are. Um, some red ember cayennes. Some buena mulatas. Got some cabbage going on down here under the lights. We got some red Trinidad Congos, some Pimenta Pardons, some yellow Trinidad Scorpions, some black Hungarians. Got some more tomatoes over here. These are my greenhouse tomatoes. We got Pink Wonder and Clementine and Sakura. These guys were leggy. I left them in the germination chamber, didn't catch, check them for one whole day and they got really really leggy so i've got these planted deep in a deep cell tray and so they're going to recover just fine they'll be good and i've got some uh brown marugas down here and some red brain red naga brains and some some other things here we got some young carolina reapers getting going here and a few other things in there too but it's mostly reapers and uh some Thunder Cacho Brown Cayennes and some Trinidad Perfumes and some Red uh, Cacho uh, Thunder Cayennes, some Ahi Fantasies and Ahi Crystals and Guyanos. Uh, we've got quite a bit going on. Sorry about the spin there. I didn't think to slow down for you. We got some asparagus happening there. Look how beautiful them peppers are getting back there. Ain't that just gorgeous? Don't you just love seeing that? This, you know, it's just, it's, it's stunning. And uh, we rotated the peppers out that were down here. Um, putting some of this lettuce and stuff under these lights. Get it a little jump start. Cabbage lettuce. Look at this, uh, look how beautiful. This red ember cayenne is really, really, really happy with that. I right hear we got a Korean dark green that's looking really good. Good looking plant. Oh, we got some young plants back here. We've got. Let's see, we got some oregano that is just looking gorgeous and stunning back there. Look at that oregano. And some chocolate beauty bell peppers and some Zulu black bell peppers. Some more tomatoes, got some big rainbow back there. And oh, we got some old Germans. Some basil going on here. Some West... Indies red habaneros and some red congos. Put this light up since we talked last, or maybe I had to repair it anyway. I had uh, 
one ballast was bad when I set, hooked that old used light up and the other ballast went bad. So I already had it hung. So I haven't put new ballast in it. If I'd, if I'd known that in the beginning, I probably wouldn't have even used that light, but it's up there now. So it's working. We got uh, heat mats up there. That stuff's on heat mats. Uh, got these lights working well here and I'll be adding lights to this one tomorrow. So anyway, it's working quite well. We're very happy. Got some more peppers down here, of course. Do got a few, you know, oopses happen. And I let one of my intense lights get a little too hot on these. This is a peach sugar rush. Luckily, it wasn't one of my rare peppers. I lost a, lost one, but the rest of them are coming back quite well. This one got a little bit scorched, but it's it's doing good now, so it'll take a little time. Most of these will come back. Let's see. Actually, I think they may all come back. I got one that looks a little peaked, but I think they'll all come back. My light was just too hot for them. Too hot. Burn, burn them, burn them, burn them. I did lose a couple of... Uh, couple of peppers i think i lost one puma pepper but it happens we got several things going on got some eggplant back there and some brassicas and cabbage so anyway hope y'all enjoyed this little short video just trying to keep you updated on what we got going on as we grow along and prepare for our 1000 pepper year we are looking to plant and i don't know if we will but we're trying to plant a thousand peppers this year so anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Have a good one. See you later.